And tonight, parishioners at a church in Providence are mourning the loss of their pastor. Father Joe Santos was the beloved priest at Holy Name of Jesus Parish. He died over the weekend after contracting COVID-19. Father Santos is the second priest to die in the state this year after catching the virus. And tonight, we're hearing from those who knew him best. 12 News reporter Amanda Pitts is live outside of the church with more. Amanda. Father Joe Santos spent a month in the hospital battling COVID-19, and on Saturday, he lost that battle. He led this parish for close to 20 years, leaving a mark on not only parishioners, but on fellow priests as well. Very deep sadness, yes, very deep sadness, because he was beloved. The beloved pastor of Holy Name of Jesus Parish in Providence, Father Joe Santos, losing his battle with COVID-19 on Saturday after fighting for a month. Yeah, it reminds us of how serious this illness is and um, how we all need to be careful. He was just 62. We go back to 1974. We rode this bus together to go to high school. Um, and we've been friends ever since. You know, Joe always had uh, the desire to be a priest, as I did. And we both realized that dream. Uh, we both priests for more than 30 years. Father Joe Escobar is pastor of Our Lady of the Rosary Church in Providence. He says Pastor Santos was a unique pastor, leading a church that's home to three communities, Holy Name Parish, Latin Mass Community, and the African Catholic Community. All three coexist under one church roof, and Father Santos was pastor to all of them, and they loved him and he loved them, and it was just a great experience. He had the heart of a priest, as they say. He was a very good pastor. Father Santos was also a proud Bristolian. And walked in the 4th of July parade every year. And was a wealth of knowledge to other priests. He was kind of like Google for us. Like you could ask Joe any question, even an obscure religious thing, and Joe would know the answer. And he was very good about cleaning out churches that closed. And if you needed something for your church, you'd call Joe first because he would have it in his basement. You know, it was, just, it was just a unique guy. Those quirks are what Pastor Escobar says will be missed most. And losing him, we've lost a great treasure for that. Now calling hours are Friday night from 4 to 7 here at Holy Name, and a mass is set for Saturday morning at 10. In Providence, Amanda Pitts, 12 News.